Welcome to Easterfest video blog day 8. As you can see, no Sarah today, we seem to be tag teaming, she's crook and so won't be joining today, hopefully she'll be on board tomorrow. We are going to see one of your questions answered. Hannah Jane asked if the layout this year has changed from last year and if the story is going to be the same. So we're going to go find out. Right here, we're putting up the new Easterfest sign. It's going to be LEDs, very exciting. We'll show you that in a couple of days. And as you might also be able to see, the entrance tent this year has been turned 90 degrees. So it's not straight down, but it's sideways. Just here, we're going to have the Easterfest foyer store. This is where anyone can come and buy all their merch. Anyone from the city can walk in and get their merch from here, or Easterfest goers can come and get their merch here. If you're on crew this year, I'll show you where you're going to eat. Over here on the right, you'll register. This is where you'll get your armband checked right through here. And here is where you'll be eating. Last year, the Yes He Is Cafe was located just over here. This year, it's going to be the guest area and the green room. Very excited to announce that the Yes He Is Cafe is actually moved to its own venue. So follow me. And here we are, right in the heart of where the Yes He Is Cafe is located. We have a stage over here so there will be great live acts and there will not be a tractor on the day. Just here for the very first time, Easterfest TV. We're going to show you a lot more about that in coming days. We're standing right now in the Just Motivation precinct. This year this is a brand new area, we are very excited. You'll get your opportunities to pitch in for social justice. We've got the Compassion guys coming here so you can sponsor a child or you can support the Red Frogs Chaplaincy Network or you could donate to the local soup kitchen, among other things. Not actually up yet, but soon to come is going to be an exciting new venue called The Forum where there will be up to 10 hours of speakers a day. We've got Tony Gear here and he's going to show us a little bit about an exciting new venue. Okay, so as an exciting bit of information for Easterfest viewers, we have here last year some rain and we're having tank stage. So we're going to fence this off and we're going to put people up on top of the tank and you have a really good stage. What do you think? <laughs> That's very exciting. The acoustics should be good. Yeah. What sort of acts have we got going on there? Um, well, we haven't actually come up with all the acts that are going to be performing there, but we'll be sending it out via Twitter and Facebook Very and uh, people will be right onto it. Oh, awesome. I bet everyone will be keen for their opportunity to play on the tank stage. And uh, have you worked out what the date is today? Today would be the first. <laughs> well done. Well done. <laughs> And there you have it, Tony Gear, a man to fear, he'll get you every time, you got me. Anyhow, thanks for joining us on Easterfest Day 8, hopefully Sarah will be joining me tomorrow. And make sure you buy your tickets and check us out on Facebook, Twitter or YouTube. We'll see you tomorrow.